Hello everybody. Well, we've got a full moon in Aquarius, 20 degrees Aquarius on the 13th of August. <clears throat> now, Aquarius is very much about change, the new, disrupting the old order. And boy, are we seeing that around the world now. The riots that we've had in the United Kingdom, the tsunamis, the earthquakes, there's a huge amount of change happening in our world. And of course, that's affecting us not only on the global level, but on the personal level. And this full moon in Aquarius, wherever it falls in your chart, is going to show you where you may need to make some serious changes. You might be frightened of making those changes, but it's also where you need to be more independent. So, for example, let's say this full moon is falling in your fourth house of home. Maybe this is going to bring you some changes or upheavals in your family or your living situation. Maybe you know you need to move from where you are, but you've been just too frightened to put it together. Uh, the full moon in Aquarius is going to illuminate this for you and also give you the opportunity to come up with creative solutions because that's what Aquarius is all about. It's about you being the individual that you are, just unique, different, and being willing to come up with new ideas to solve difficult problems. And maybe it's in your financial house. So maybe this is a wonderful time to start an off-the-wall business, a completely different kind of business, but something that really appeals to you that might just catch on. The full moon in Aquarius would rule anything connected with social networking. Great time to do anything socially. Good time to volunteer in your community to help in some kind of a way. Um, it's a good time to have a brainstorming session with other people coming up with new ideas. Um, <clears throat> it's also a good time to reach out to others and be compassionate and caring. Um, it's a good time to appreciate your freedom. And if you're not feeling free, especially where it falls in your chart, this is where you're going to want a need to break out. Um, it's a great time for doing something new and creative, for doing something really ridiculous for just being you and not caring what other people are thinking about it. So really study what makes you different and do it during this full moon in Aquarius. So um, I'm expecting as well that this full moon is probably going to bring some massive changes again. The effects of the full moon last up to two weeks afterwards. So I'm expecting a lot more changes and a lot more surprises in the markets um, we've seen the stock market drop, we've seen it go back up again. All this kind of volatility is very much related to this full moon in Aquarius that we've got. So I wish you a very happy, unique, different and eccentric moon in Aquarius. Thank you for listening and if you want more detail go to my website and have a look at my article and it gives you some more information about questions you can ask yourself and good things to do during this full moon. Thanks for listening, bye for now.